Hey everybody, right here, day 116, carnivore diet journey, and uh, a pretty good day, uh, but I've decided I need to put some focus back on something. All right. Um, so, also, um, you know, want everybody to, you know, throw some comments down there. Uh, I've been pretty busy at work, so I haven't got back to all the comments the last day or two, maybe. But um, I, I do enjoy the comments. I like corresponding with you guys. Um, and then, you know, hit the subscribe button so you can see the new videos and uh, see what happens when I hit my next goal. But, um, yeah, so like, comment, subscribe. Uh, what I'm going to try and put a little bit more focus back on is actually my sugar and my ketones. Um, I haven't been paying super close attention to that and I started thinking about it today in the middle of a uh, bunch of work that I had to do that I just had to like clear my mind for a few minutes and I just uh, decided to think about my diet. So um, I haven't been as diligent with checking my blood sugar and my ketones each and every day. Uh, I haven't done it on the weekends in quite some time. but. I think I need to do that. I think I need to use that as a as the barometer that it is of how well I am eating and how clean I am eating. Um, I've kind of noticed now that I hit my, you know, I hit the 260 and now I'm back up a little bit. Uh, today is 247, or no, I'm sorry, not 247. 264.7 is my weight today. So it's back up a little bit. It's actually down a little bit from yesterday, down a little bit from the day before, but um, it's up from where I was at the beginning of the week. I'm traveling. Uh, I'm eating out for dinner every day. Um, and that is contributing to me not having quite as clean food. And I think it's also affecting my ketosis. So what I'm going to do is, is put a little bit more focus back on that. Um, and I really, really thought about it tonight as I was sitting at dinner, um, another, another Mexican restaurant uh, down in Laredo. Um, and I had the tacos del pastor, but no tortilla. I didn't eat the pineapple or any of that stuff. Um, I just, just ate the meat. Um, and it wasn't a ton. And they had like a a green sauce that came with it. And I was like, yeah, I'll dip the meat in there a little bit. And uh, as I'm dipping the meat in there, I'm realizing, I'm like, this is not how I got where I'm at. Um, so I'm a little disappointed that I'm letting myself do that and let myself slide a little bit. So I'm gonna try and be cleaner, right? Lunchtime today, um, a gentleman from the facility, he, he he did barbecue. Uh, I believe one of the vendors may have uh, donated the meat and everything. Uh, so we had uh, beef ribs. We had beef ribs, chicken, uh, sausage, and, uh, and steak. Um, you know, barbecued like fajita steak. So it's delicious. It was it was awesome. And there was tortillas, and there was salsas, and there was everything else. But I didn't worry about it. Uh, I just went ahead and just ate the meat. Um, ate quite a bit of meat too, actually. It's one of the reasons I went for the tacos for dinner because um, I had eaten quite a bit of meat at lunch and I didn't want to really get too much at dinner. You know, I, I and what I ate, I was full with. But, um, you know, I just, I just ate my pastor, dipped it in the salsa a little bit. Um, but that was, again, not how I got to the place where I'm at. I got to the place where I'm at by not dipping it in the salsa. Um, by not ordering the El Pastor, but ordering just some steak or some fajita meat, which is probably what I should have done tonight. Just done some, some chicken fajita meat. But I'm, uh, I'm, I'm trying to realize that, admit that to myself, 
and make a little bit of an adjustment now. So um, I'm going to start getting back on my, my sugar, my ketones, and everything else. Um, so this morning, kind of late morning, almost lunchtime, I did my, my measurements for my, my sugars and my ketones. My sugar came in at 105, um, so I'm real happy with a 105. Um, my ketones came in at 0.7, so it's not above, you know, kind of baseline of a four or five, but it's not over one where I really want to maintain. Um, I would love to be closer to, to two or even in the twos, but um, I need to get back there first. I need to be clean eating, no carbs, uh, avoid the sauces, all of those things, and then I will be back where I want to be. That's what I would expect. Um, so I'm gonna gonna clean that up, um, and I because I, I really do. I wanna I wanna hit my number by the. I would love to hit my number by the 22nd, uh, but in order to do that now, I need to lose 14.9 pounds in the next 16 days. So nearly a pound a day. Um, that's going to be very difficult. So I'm going to be as clean as I can. Um, that means I have to skip a meal because what's available isn't going to work. I'm going to have to skip the meal. Um, but I'll make up for it with more clean food afterwards. Um, I've got my eggs. I've got my... Um, Eggs and hamburger patties I have for tomorrow. Probably gonna get up tomorrow morning and just eat a couple of eggs um, so that I don't get too hungry during the day. Um, but, you know, that's that's what I gotta do is just kind of be clean, maintain, and not fall prey to call it cravings or call it laziness. Um, that's what I gotta do. So. Um, I think that's really what I wanted to talk about. I, like I said, I've been thinking about this today. It's just, my head was spinning today and I was like, I need to, I need to reset my brain, think about something else. Um, thought about this and then at dinner, as I'm eating it, it really, really kind of hit me. So I'm going to clean it up and, uh, hopefully get back get back on a, on a good path through the beginning of my trip. Because I, I know that on a trip, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna stray a little bit here and there. I'm, I'm gonna allow myself that. Um, I wanna be very careful with it because uh, I don't wanna just go hog wild and you know have a bowl of rice. Um, but I may have a little bit of sauces. Um, Things like that. I still want to keep it very, very low carb, but I'll allow myself a little bit more. But we'll we'll see. Um, I'm gonna avoid breading and things like that that messed up my stomach earlier in the week. So that's that's it. So starting to kind of ramble a little bit. So I'll wrap it up. Um, again, like, comment, subscribe. The more subscribers. The more it gets presented, the more it gets presented, the more subscribers, the more people find this diet. Hopefully find some encouragement from an idiot like me who is, is realizing and I need to take a look at myself and, and really think about, am I doing what I'm supposed to be doing right now? So, yeah, on that, I uh, don't have anything to say else, so I will bid you adieu and I will talk to you tomorrow.